Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the presentation of the colors and remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for the National Anthem. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, Cadet Major Elias Carcamo and JROTC. Please be seated. Distinguished platform guests, 2017 graduates, members of the faculty, family, and friends, as principal of Bryan Adams High School Leadership Academy, I welcome you to this momentous occasion. The members of the graduating class, along with the guidance from their family, friends, and teachers have worked hard to accomplish this honor. Class of 2017, today is your time to reflect on your years at Brian Adams High School, and it is your day to celebrate your accomplishments. For the past four years, I have witnessed great things from the class of 2017, and I must say it has been an honor to be your principal for these past four years. This year, 100% of seniors completed their college applications. Over 68% of seniors completed their FAFSA and TASFA applications, up 8% from last year. As a graduating class, you have earned $10,172,736 in merit scholarship money. I can't begin to tell you how excited I am to see so many students making their college dreams a reality. 
Class of 2017, not only have you left your mark by earning numerous awards, winning multiple championships, completing thousands of community service hours, but you are leaving your school a better place for future scholars. You have helped to create and implement the Leadership Academy, and you have demonstrated your leadership through your numerous community service projects that you have led, as well as continuing to build and create more than 60 all-inclusive clubs and organizations that will impact students for years to come. Class of 2017, thank you for your service, your leadership to our campus and the community. After you walk across the stage today, you'll each be on your own journey. Whether you're going to college, the military, or entering a career, we all want you to know we are proud of you and we are here for you. This time, it is my honor to introduce our distinguished guest, District 3 Trustee and Board President Dan Mishke, <laughs> Dallas ISD Deputy Chief of School Leadership Brian Lusk, <laughs> Executive Director of the Brian Adams Feeder Pattern Dr. Joanne Hughes, <laughs> and now my faculty and staff, Assistant Principals Israel Cabrera. Stephanie Fuller, Mike Moran, Mallory McLaughlin, Beth Wing, and Senior Class Assistant Principal Carisha Hearns. <laughs> Guidance Counselors Katherine Evans, Stephanie Gibbons, Shannon Rodriguez, and our Senior Counselors Laura Lake Berrios and Nikita Jones. I would also like to thank Ms. Crystal Ellis, our AVID coordinator, and Ms. Khan Lamanov with Academic Success Program for their dedication to helping our students be college bound. Also, I want to thank the excellent teachers and support staff at Bryan Adams High School for helping our students reach and exceed their goals. Teachers and support staff, please rise to be acknowledged. Let's give them a round of applause for their hard work. I would also like to recognize our feeder pattern elementary and middle school principals for setting the solid foundation for our students and supporting our students from kindergarten through their high school career and beyond. Principals, please stand to be recognized. Principal Sharon Staus, Gaston Middle School. Principal Candice Ruiz, Robert T. Hill Middle School. Principal Hector Martinez, Alex Singer Elementary and Preparatory Middle School. Principal Laura Morris, Larry D. Smith Middle School. Principal Phoebe Montgomery, Reinhardt Elementary. Principal Damien Stoball, Charles A. Gill Elementary. Principal Oscar Aponte, Casa View Elementary. Principal Yasmin Cruz, Edwin J. Keast Elementary. Principal Marion Jackson with Riley Elementary. Principal Jennifer Jackson with Hexter Elementary. Robbie Wilson with Bales Elementary. Principals, thank you for your continued support. It is important that we all recognize the most essential people who have helped us get here today, our parents. Our parents helped us every step of the way. Seniors, give your parents a round of applause for their continued support and enduring love. Thank you, parents. I'd also like to recognize our student council leaders. Leading our senior class are four amazing students who deserve recognition. President April Benitez. Vice President Alondra Hernandez, Secretary Ashley Hernandez, and Parliamentarian Daniela Lopez. Senior Sponsor Christy James. Next, we honor the members of our National Honor Society. National Honor Society students, please stand to be recognized. You may be seated. Also, those students graduating at the top 10 of their class, please stand to be recognized. <laughs> Seniors who completed their senior exhibition, please stand to be recognized. Congratulations, seniors. Before we begin today's events, 
We ask that you please lend dignity and honor to this graduation ceremony. Only the best manner should be displayed as each family wishes to hear their graduate's name called. The mark of good character is to display courtesy to others. I'm sure that you will demonstrate that type of character today. Now it is my honor to welcome our 2017 salutatorian, Nancy Barajas Ramirez. Nancy will be attending Albion College in Michigan. Welcome, staff, families, and fellow graduates. I would like to start off by thanking my parents and family for their unlimited love and support. Quiero tomar este momento para agradecer a mi familia y padres for darme su amor y apoyo ilimitadamente. Also, to my AVID family, my SP family, and teachers and staff that have helped in my success along the way. We're gathered here today to celebrate our completion of high school, four years of bittersweet memories. From the terrifying first day of high school to, to hearing over the announcements, I remember Cougars as we strive for excellence. Here at Brian Adams, we are tenacious, collaborative, and perfect. <laughs> to this day, to our ride. We're, now as we say goodbye to high school, we find ourselves in a weird position. We're going from teens to adults. As we take the next step into our lives to create new beginnings. As a freshman, I had just moved from California. I started high school not knowing anyone and feeling alone. Luckily, I was welcomed in quickly. I soon learned that many of my new friends had been together in the same schools since kindergarten. At times, I would listen to their funny memories they would have about each other. At this, all I could do was laugh and recall my own awkward slash funny memories. And although at times their shared memories let me feel outside, no one ever let me feel like an outsider. Despite my late start, I soon found my place among with it, many others that helped me realize how welcoming Brian and Ams can be. I see how fast I was able to make meaningful connections and memories that will last a lifetime. In 2011, when I first came to the United States from Mexico, I came with the mindset that I was coming to this country to study and make sure I had a future I could be proud of. I, de I decided to take the advantage of the opportunity in and start a new life in a new place filled with opportunities. Looking back at these times when I first came to the United States, I like to call them my tryout times. I was able to use my new experiences to shape who I wanted to become without shame or judgment. Now I realize the high school has been a continuation of these tryout times, getting all of us ready for what lies ahead and who each of us will become. While high school might seem at times like the end of the world, well, at least our world, we have had some of our greatest times at senior homecoming game or com and commitment day, and equally face some of our most challenging obstacles, as staying past 2 a.m. working on homework or working on late, late assignments. Guess what? We still have more challenges ahead. But no worries, we still have more moments to shine. This is what high school has been for me, a balance of events, going through our worst days to know how to appreciate the best. With each phase we overcome in life, we leave something behind, a place, a routine, a sense of comfort. However, each time we begin something new, we know that we have friends, family, and people that care for us along our side to help us with our next, next set of trials. As I reflect on my journey from being a new student in a new country to starting again as a high school freshman, I realize that 
sharing values, visions, and having a connection are what matter most. I am proud to call myself a Brian Adams Cougar, and I'm also honored to see each of you succeed in your next set, in your, in your next goal in life. So remember, Cougars, to be true to who you are, to your values, and to be your own person in each new beginning you take in life. Congratulations, Class of 2017. Thank you. Thank you, Nancy, and congratulations on your success. It is now my honor to welcome the valedictorian for the graduating class of 2017, Suzette DeMaio. Suzette will be attending the University of Pennsylvania. Good afternoon, graduates, family, friends, and everyone that is here to witness such a special moment in our lives. We wouldn't be here if it weren't for all of you that have supported us throughout these challenging four years of high school. The summer before freshman year, we were assigned to read The Alchemist in preparation for a pre-AP English one with Mr. Moore. I'm not gonna lie, I procrastinated a lot on my first high school assignment. When I finally realized that time was running out, I decided that I should at least try to get the book. And I'm glad I did. It was after reading this book that I truly gained an understanding on life, destiny, and all of the crazy courses we travel to get to where we belong, to where we want. When I was in eighth grade, I was absolutely certain that I was going to Booker T to do theater there. I always heard that Brian Adams wasn't a good school, that the kids were bad, and that there were fights all the time. So I really thought I wouldn't like going there. After getting my rejection letter from Booker T, I still had an interest in pursuing theater. I swallowed my pride and I enrolled in Brian Adams. And I am so happy I did. We, the class of 2017, have made Brian Adams amazing. We have made it a place that is the complete opposite of what I once feared. Brian Adams has become my home, our home. The place where we've spent most of our time these past four years. The place where we've made countless unforgettable memories and lifelong unbreakable friendships. Things didn't always go as planned. In fact, it was very rare that things ever seemed to go the way we wanted them to. Yet now, as we look back on everything that made up our high school experience, there's no other way it could have gone. We've lived the happiest, saddest, and scariest moments of our lives there. Every single person we've met and every memory we've made has become a building block to who we are today, an essential part of that leads to the path we are meant to be. Sophomore year, my mom faced problems because of her immigration status. I was afraid of being separated from my mother, the woman that has always given me everything she could. It was definitely a difficult experience, knowing that her case could determine whether I had my mother there every morning before going to school and every night before going to bed. My parents put a lot into making sure that everything would work out just fine. They got a good lawyer and we all did everything we could. It was scary but we won the case. And my mom is sitting right there to see me graduate today. Mom, Dad, you two are the reason why I'm standing here today. Why I pushed myself every day to make you two proud. Mommy, Papi, ustedes dos son la razón por la que estoy de pie aquí hoy. La razón por la que me empuje cada día para hacerlos orgullosos. Before all of this happened, my mom and I have talked about bell tryouts. And I know it wasn't the perfect time to ask, considering all of the money they were investing on a good lawyer. But my mom convinced my dad to at least let me try out. I tried out and I made the team. I wouldn't have made all the beautiful memories on the team if it weren't for my parents' love, support, and hard work. I never imagined having to live through something like that. But now I can go back and think of it as an obstacle that brought the whole family together, and that made me appreciate my parents even more than what I did. Life has its ups and downs, and we have a lot of those waiting for us as we leave high school and take another step until it becomes our own life. It will be difficult, and the turns life will take will be frightening, especially now that we'll be adults. 
having to make our own decisions for the rest of our lives. But no worries, this is where our friends come in. The beautiful friendships we've made so far have been a big part of the wonder we've experienced in our lives. They have been there for everything we can think of, for some of the happiest moments to make a smile even bigger, for some of the saddest moments to hug us a bit tighter and remind us that it'll be okay, even when it's not. After all, being crazy alone is a hard thing to do, but having someone else to be crazy with makes life worth living. The friendships we made in high school will forever be dear to our hearts, and it is going to be hard not seeing them every day. But we all have those friendships that we just know will last a lifetime. My theater family has become an important part of my life that I hope to have forever. We've made some of the best memories ever. I am very thankful to have people that I can look to when life gets too overwhelming or when I just want to have fun. Some of my favorite memories from high school have been with my theater family and Ithaca Squad. For those of you who don't know, that's what Lorena Correa, Daniel Wynn, and I call our little group because we applied to Ithaca College and a few other schools together. High school has been a great chapter in the book of our lives, but it's, it's time to move on to the next great chapter because this is not where the story ends. We've grown and we've gone through a lot to get to this moment, our graduation. Brian Adams was our home for whole, four whole years and our time there was great. It became the foundation for the rest of our lives, for our now. It was an important part of our lives and ourselves that has gotten us closer to where we are meant to be. The crazy, unexpected paths of lives will take us to a place we probably haven't just thought about just yet. Although coming to Brian Adams wasn't my original plan, it's the path I decided to take, and it was the best journey I could have asked for. Although I thought differently at first, I wouldn't change one thing about these past four years. Whatever turns we decide to take, when we trace them back to the beginning, Brian Adams will always be there. And I am proud to say that I am a graduating Brian Adams Cougar. And so I close with a quote from The Alchemist by Paulo Coelho. We are travelers on a cosmic journey, stardust, swirling and dancing in the eddies and whirlpools of infinity. Life is eternal. We have stopped for a moment to encounter each other, to meet, to love, to share. This is a precious moment. It is a little parenthesis in eternity. Making a decision was only the beginning of things. When someone makes a decision, he is really diving into a strong current that will carry him to places he had never dreamed of when he first made the decision. It's time to build our own lives, to continue to grow, learn from the mistakes we've made and the ones we'll make, and to trust that whatever happens throughout the crazy courses of life, we will get to where we want and to where we belong. Keep on being tenacious, collaborative, and reflective. Brian Adams, class of 2017, congratulations. Thank you.
At this time, April Benitez, senior class president, will introduce our distinguished speaker. As senior class president, it is my honor to introduce Mr. Dan Mitch K, the Dallas ISD Board of Trustees president and trustee for District 3. Mr. Mitch K received his BA with highest honors from Stony Brook University, where he was a member of the Phi Beta Kappa. He received his JD from the University of Chicago Law School. Mr. Mitch K is a partner at the law firm of Aiken, Gump, Strauss, Hauer, and Feld. He has been recognized by D Magazine as one of the best lawyers in Dallas, by Texas Monthly as a super lawyer, and as one of the best lawyers in America. A champion of public education, Mr. Mitch K chaired his firm's school partnership program with James W. Fannin Elementary School from 2005 to 2012. The program won the State Board of Education's highest award for community partnerships in 2011. Mr. Mitch K has lived in Dallas since 1981 and has been a resident of the Dallas ISD District 3 for more than 17 years. Mr. Mitch K, the class of 2017 is honored to have you here today and thank you for all you have done and continue to do for the students of the Dallas Independent School District. Well, thank you very much for that kind introduction. Good afternoon, graduates, and congratulations on the accomplishments that we're celebrating today. Your families, teachers, friends, and all of us are so very proud of you. As a member of the school board, it is a high honor for me to be able to say a few words to you, the Brian Adams class of 2017, as you move on to another exciting phase of your life. As graduates, you're embarking on a new journey. You will have more opportunities, face more challenges, and make many hard decisions. You have the ability to determine your own destiny. My advice to you is to follow your dreams, reach for the stars, and never give up on yourself. Whatever your dreams are, you must understand that you're not likely to reach them easily or quickly. Along the way, you will have disappointments and setbacks. Almost every successful person, every person who has achieved his or her dream has, has had to overcome setbacks before they succeeded. Nelson Mandela said, the greatest glory in living lies not in never falling, but in rising every time we fall. Winston Churchill expressed the same sentiment in a different way. When you're going through hell, keep going. In another speech, Churchill describes success as the ability to go from one failure to another with no loss of enthusiasm. Abraham Lincoln is, of course, one of our greatest presidents. But before he was elected president, he ran for the state legislature and lost. He, he then ran for Congress and lost. He then ran for the Senate twice and lost. He also sought the vice presidential nomination of his party and lost. But he never gave up on himself. And when he became president in 1861, he never came up, gave up on his goal of keeping the country together despite numerous losses on the battlefields of the Civil War. We all know that Thomas Edison invented the light bulb, but not that many people know that it took him over 100 tries to do it. He did not give up. He once described his attempts this way. I did not fail a thousand times. The light bulb was an invention with a thousand steps. Whatever your dreams are, they will involve some risk of failure. Don't be afraid to follow your dreams just because you might not succeed right away. Oprah Winfrey, one of the most successful entertainers and businesswomen in history, once said, I believe that one of life's greatest risks is never daring to risk. Do the one thing you think you cannot do. Fail at it. Try again. Do better the next time. And a long time ago, Mark Twain said to a young friend, 20 years from now, you will be most disappointed by the things that you didn't try because you were afraid to fail. Wayne Gretzky, the great hockey player, hockey's all-time leading scorer, made the point this way. You miss all the shots that you don't take. 
So go out there and follow your dreams. Don't be afraid to fail. And when you stumble and fall, get back up again. Now, before I close, I would like to offer you one other suggestion. Although you've seen many of your teachers and counselors every day for the past four years, chances are pretty high that you'll never see some of them again after today. Take a minute to seek out and thank someone special who helped you get here today. You will always be glad that you made that effort. In closing, let me say again, congratulations to you, the Bride Adams class of 2017. Go Cougars, I wish you every success in life. Thank you, Trustee Mishke. As principal of Brian Adams High School Leadership Academy, I hereby affirm that each candidate has met all requirements for graduation as determined by the State of Texas and the Dallas Independent School District, and that they are qualified to receive their diplomas or they are otherwise qualified to participate in this graduation ceremony consistent with the laws of the State of Texas and the Dallas Independent School District. Good afternoon, my name is Brian Lusk. I'm the Deputy Chief of School Leadership. As Deputy Chief of School Leadership of the Dallas Independent School District, I am pleased to confirm the certification of the 2017 graduating class of Brian Adams High School Leadership Academy. This will make it official. I am pleased to award these diplomas certifying these students are graduates of the Dallas Independent School District. Suset Tamayo, Senior Class Valedictorian. Nancy Mariela Barajas Ramirez, Senior Class Salutatorian. April Naomi Benitez, Senior Class President. Alondra Maria Hernandez, Senior Class Vice President. Daniela Lopez, Senior Class Parliamentarian. Ashley Hernandez, Senior Class Secretary. Rodolfo Vieira, Top 10%. Elias Palmitano, Top 10%. Karina Carlos, Top 10%. Cindy Salinas, top 10%. Claudia Hernandez Sandoval, top 10%. Jessica Jane Burkett, top 10%. Christopher Leonardo Anaya, top 10%. Osvaldo Rodriguez, top 10%. Emma May Howell, top 10%. Martin Alexander Valdez, top 10%. Luis David Ochoa, top 10%. Carlos Escobedo, top 10%. Anthony Rene Rodriguez, top 10%. Leah Jaret Vega, top 10%. Ashley Gutierrez, top 10%. Cheyenne Banuelos, top 10%. Erica Andrade, top 10%.
James Curtis, top 10 percent. Daniel Wynn, top 10 percent. Edwin Artiaga Medrano, top 10 percent. Hugo Chaveria, top 10 percent. Mariana Sierra, top 10 percent. Elvia Lopez, top 10 percent. Leslie Abigail Ortega, top 10 percent. Victor Ramundo Reza, top 10 percent. Juana Gonzalez, top 10 percent. Lisette Hernandez Moctezuma, top 10 percent. Lorena Correa, top 10 percent. Annabelle Garcia, top 10 percent. Dylan Lopez, top 10 percent. Luke Harrison Malone, top 10 percent. Vanessa Altamirano, top 10 percent. Ernesto Alonzo Silva, top 10 percent. Miranda S. Tristan, top 10 percent. Annette Michelle Flores, top 10 percent. Mary Carmen Rodriguez, top 10 percent. Antoine Adams. Ruby Aguirre. Roberto Arturo Alvaran Arias. Zachary Ethan Allen. Angel Alvarez. Leslie Diana Alvarez Vega. Francisco Alvarez Oviedo. Ilaria Angel Palomino. Christelle Hope Anthony. Samantha Aracachi. Adalita Aranda. Vanessa Arias Zapata. Alfredo Arredondo. Eric Araguin. Alan Daniel Ariaga. Brenda Guadalupe Ariaga. Enrique Avila Jr. Lucy Avila. Aurora Valderas Mendoza. David Banda. Diego Eduardo Barboza Mata. Elizabeth Marie Barnes. Moraima Barnabe. Adalis Barnabe. Perla Samantha Beraspe. Alfred Ahmad Marquis Raziel. Uriel Briseno. Brandy Brown. Kia Cheyenne Brown. Liberty Yvonne Brown. Axel Caldera Cumplido. Yamil Noemi Calderon. Leslie S. Calvillo. 
Alexander Viegas Camarillo. Lupita Campos. Zitlali Jasmine Cantu Cruz. Anaí Cardoso. Earl Carmen the Fourth. Juan Manuel Carrizales. Landon Elliot Carter. Dallas Keith Carter. Brian Alexander Castaneda. Jennifer Castaneda. Jose Castaneda. Freddy Castillo. Angeles Castro. Yesenia Severa. Wakar Hussein Shadri. Juan Antonio Chavez. Tanya Elizabeth Chavez. Yadira Cisneros. Kanisia Kiera Clark. Nakia A. Clark. Kiajane Chandria Cole. Monicia Monet Coleman. Eduardo Contreras. Fasia Cooper. Esmeralda Corona. Emmanuel Victor Cortez. Kelly Adrienne Corzo. Jocelyn Gonzalez Crescenciano. Deontay Lee Damone Crowder. Carlos Josue Cruz. Jennifer Cruz. Jose J. Cruz. Ricardo Cruz. Williams Alexander Cruz. Juan Cubios. Yasmin Cuevas. Mahalia Davidson. Kiera Monique Davis. Stephanie De La Torre. David De Leon. Astrid Amy De Leon Diaz. Brandon Andrew Decker. Ricardo De La Cruz. Daisy Delgado. Kanai Iman Derek. Michaela Alante Derek. Moonod D. Juan Dimas. Stephen Dorado. 
Anthony Benjamin Duran. Kimberly Duran. Celeste Enriquez. Neb Hermias. Azucena Escalante. Natalie Escobar Castillo. Mia Esparza. Alejandro Espinoza. Celine Faith Espinoza. Donald N. Espinoza. Melanie Ann Espinoza. Noe Neri Espinoza. Yvette Espercueta. Guadalupe Estrada. Juan Estrada Rodriguez. Madison Nicole Farago. Dani Favala. Carla Flores. Crystal Flores. Eli Flores. Roman Flores the third. San Juana Celine Flores Moreno. Miracle Tierra Lachey Francis. Victor D. Frenchwood Jr. Luis Daniel Frias. Luis Angel Galaviz. Paola Galicia. Emmanuel Gallardo. Rosa Gallegos. Alma Lisbeth Galvan. Jessica Guadalupe Gamiz. Alvin J. Garcia. Jocelyn Garcia. Nathaniel Jacob Garcia. Perla Isel Garcia. Gabriel Arturo Gomez. Luis Angel Gomez. Ty Gonzalez Gando. Uventino Angel Gonzalez. Martin Gonzalez. Ramon Rogelio Gonzalez. Juana Lizette Gonzalez Pina. Daisy Gadea. Juan Manuel Guerrero. Vida Guia. Chris Gutierrez. Melissa Gutierrez. Jaylene Guzman. 
Johan Pedro Guzman. Ryan Eric Hancock. Kiana Antoinette Hardrick. Deja Sumiko Hatch. Jordan Ernest Hatcher. Ladeja Hayden. Fanny Hernandez. Joshua Hernandez. Marco Hernandez. Nestor Hernandez. Margarita Hernandez Camargo. Giselle Herrera. Ricardo Herrera. Kavon Jackson. Leslie Jaime. Andy Hymas Jr. Maria Estefania Harrell. Jasmine Jacqueline James. Danisha LaShawn Johnson. La Quinciera Lane Johnson. Fernando D. Jones. Rashardé Jones. Ray Jordan the third. Edwin Ociel Juarez. Michelle Juarez Perez. Kelson Camu. Antonio King. Alexander Lamuri Griffin. <laughs> Stephanie Ledesma. Alexandra Leon. Leticia Leon. Rocio Lamas. Kirby Metcalf Lorengo. Gregorio Jr. Longoria. Aaron Lopez. Alejandro Lopez. Benjamin Lopez. Luis Alberto Lopez. Richard Lopez. Lizzi Joali Lopez Vargas. Sidlali Lugo. Anayeli Macedo. 
Jesus Madrigal. Gabriel Almanza Mancias. Ulisa Marquez. Perry Jenkins Martin. Christian Martinez. Crystal Yvette Martinez. Iris Vanessa Martinez. Joel Martinez. Julio Ronaldo Martinez. Nayeli Martinez. Edith Talia Medrano. Marta Melendez. Oscar Antonio Mendez. Raul G. Mendez Jr. Sophia C. Mendez. Efrain Mendoza. Elizabeth Mendoza. Karina Mendoza. Ariana Michelle Miku. Jose Luis Milan. Leslie Lamar Miranda. Juan Martin Mojica the second. Saira Molina. Luis Fernando Mondragon. Ruben Mondragon, Jr. Jesus Umberto Mora. Abel Morales. Brenda Morales. Oscar Morales. Michelle Moran. Eileen Natalie Moreno. Alma Dalia Moreno. Juan Manuel Moreno. Caleb Christian Morgan. Destiny A. Mosqueda. Lucero G. Munoz. Brandon Wesley Munsell. Julio Nahara. Christian S. Nava. Diego Navarrete. Eduardo Negron. Derek Newman Jr. Caesar Manuel Nieto. Lisa Marie Nuncio. Elena Ojeda. Leslie Olguin. Maria Guadalupe Oriano. Juan Luis Ortiz. Ulysses Ortiz. 
Daniel Antonio Paderna. Ania in Palacios. Christopher James Pashan. Irma Waleska Pena Cruz. Andrew Frank Perez. Armando Perez. Fernanda Estefania Perez. Melissa Perez. Stephania Perez. <laughs> Kelly Leslie Perez Castro. Norris Edgardo Perez Villalobos. Crystal LaShawn Pierce. Luis Felipe Pina. Felix Mendoza. Jorge Pampa. Jade Canaan Pugh. Samantha Michaels Rebedo. Juan Angel Quintero. Enrique Ramirez. Eva Nicole Ramirez. Jorge Ivan Ramirez. Alan Stone Ramsey. Philip Jesse Ramsey Jr. Amy Yasmin Rango. Stephen Alexis Reyes. Bo Ray. Kenneth Reyes. Carmen Alicia Reynoso. Moses Rivas. Paola Maite Rivas. Liliana Lisbeth Rivera. Hannah Ashley Roberts. Jaslyn Corina Robinson. Elijah A. Robles. Alex Rodriguez. Alex Jose Rodriguez. Alondra Nay Rodriguez. Elsira Anahi Rodriguez. Daniel Gavina Rodriguez. Edgar Rodriguez. Hania Habalet Rodriguez. Ivan Angel Rodriguez. Jennifer Rodriguez. Joseph Daniel Rodriguez. Yadira Yvette Rodriguez. Hanya Rojas. Jacqueline Rojas. Juan Alberto Rojas Jr. Carlos Romero. Adrian E. Romo. 
Ronald Omar Rosales. Sandra Guadalupe Rubio. Stefan Rudolph. Maritza Ruiz. Jesus Emmanuel Ruiz Bocanegra. Diego Benjamin Ruiz Garcia. Federico Saavedra. Rolando Saldana. Elabeth Saldivar. Asael Salgado. Samantha Nicole Salinas. Thomas Salinas. Dominique A. Sanchez. Marco Antonio Sanchez. Ramon Anthony Sanchez. Takara Michelle Sandifer. Aaron Ruben Sandoval. Eric Rene Sandoval. Lizette Sandoval. Richard Sandoval. Kavanika Lachey Sapp. Rosa Saucedo. Evelyn Serratos. Rida Fatima Shahed. Jalexis Janae Smiley. Alfredo Soria. Julian Soria. Nisa Sosa. San Juanita Soto. Valeria Soto. Deja Monet Stewart. Andy Talavera. Jorge Luis Tapane. Christopher Torres. Diana Torres. Ephraim Torres. Roberto Tranquino. Christian Trujillo. Ulysses Trujillo. Alvarez, Salma Valadez, Abigail Valdez, Vitaly Noemi Valle, Jose Eduardo Vargas. Laquisha Tanisha Bernardo. Albert Vasquez III. Alexander Vasquez. Priscilla Crystal Vasquez. Jocelyn Vasquez. Sophia Vasquez. Jocelyn Velez. 
Humberto Jesus Vidal Montero. Brian D. Vidana. Herman Villa. Mario Villasana. Kylie Danielle Watson. Brandon Weaver. Jan Wynn. Bailey Renee Weyer. Cynthia Zamaripa. Teo Zamora. Mark Anthony Zepina. Alexis Zavala. Graduates, at this time, please stand. Turn your tassels from left to right and remain standing for the Brian Adams alma mater.